scheduled to return home to the Netherlands. The 2010 election season is underway, and we've already seen some high-profile political careers derailed by the fierce anti-incumbent sentiment out there. Facing a primary challenge this Tuesday, a longtime senator with a unique problem. NBC's Kelly O'Donnell reports from Philadelphia. His 30-year Senate career on the line next Tuesday. Pennsylvania's Arlen Specter is both powerful and vulnerable. We cannot afford to lose Senator Specter. Specter has all the big endorsements, but he is at risk because just 13 months ago, Specter was a Republican. Is the party switch a bigger issue than you expected? Uh, I expected uh, people to have questions about it. I want a fresh face, a new face in. That's uh, why I'm going to vote for Mr. Seastack. Democrat Joe Sestak, a retired two-star admiral in Congress three years, is challenging Specter. I'm Joe Sestak, running against our Specter here. And using TV time to make sure voters remember this. My change in party will enable me to be re-elected. How could my Democratic establishment actually think that someone who had advanced the agenda of George Bush could literally say he's the guy for the future. Senator Specter's not just up against an anti-Washington mood, he faces a party loyalty test. Pennsylvania has a closed primary, so only registered Democrats can vote. With that hardcore Democrat who has voted against Specter for, for 30 years and sees those pictures of him with Bush, I think it's a very, you know, very hard thing for them to swallow. President Obama is now standing up for Specter. I love you and I love all Specter. Specter says he is counting on today's black clergy endorsement to get out the vote. It will be decisive, and I think that's why we'll win. Democratic leaders actively recruited Specter last year, a switch that could now make all the difference. Kelly O'Donnell, NBC News, Philadelphia. When we come back tonight, new details about a tense confrontation between President Obama and this country's top military brass.